It's 10 minute talk show. Thank you for wooing. It's a talk show, 10 minutes in length. Yeah, what's going on, everybody? Oh, you did. We got people wooing on each side. We got a man with large hands clapping. We're in very good shape. Uh, so, welcome. Um, it's uh, It's been a tumultuous month. I don't know if you know about this, but there's some people, uh, a very vocal minority out in Alberta, who are still very upset of how the election unfolded. Yeah. And there's people in Alberta who are threatening to separate from Canada. <gasps> what? Now, I just want to say uh, I do have an, uh, a seven year old daughter, and I do know how to deal with somebody who is folding their arms and pouting. So if I, Alberta, could you just come in here for a second? Just come here for a sec, Alberta, just come here. Actually, just, Alberta, just come here for a sec, Alberta. I just wanna, hey champ, um, <laughs> I, I know you're upset that your blue guy didn't win, okay? I know, but you know what? You had your other blue guy for like nine years and that was fine, right? Remember him, the other blue guy? Yeah. yeah. Well, now the red guy's in charge cause you gotta take turns. That's how it works, okay, buddy? <laughs> You gotta give the red guy a chance just for a little bit, and he's not so bad. He buys pipelines too. He's more <laughs> he's more similar than you even know. You guys are gonna get along just fine, and he's that nice white color that you like. Don't worry, <laughs> it's gonna be okay. All right, I got you. I got you. Just just unfold your arms and uh, stop pouting. Put that bad bone away. A bird's gonna land on it. Okay, <laughs> and uh, let's grab your bat and get in the escalator. We'll knock over some mailboxes. That'll make you feel better. Okay, buddy. <laughs> all right, buck up. Here we go. I think we solved that. I think we're all right. Uh, hey, let's meet some people who are awesome, shall we? Uh, you're okay? You're good with awesome people? You're awesome fun? Uh, between the two of them, they are uh, influencers. They are internet famous. They are child stars. They are, uh, they are podcasters. And they're just two delightful individuals that are also shorter than me. And that's how they got the gig. Please welcome the stars of Potty Talk. It's Tori Webster and Jacqueline Forbes, everybody. Hello. Hello. Oh, hi. Hi. Hey, how are you? This is fun. Uh, for those who don't know, this is part two of our show exchange. It is. I Love. did your show. Yes. And, and you were thrilled to have on the pod. I, w I had a lot of we're returning actually. the favor. I authentic. You're returning yeah, the favor. Yeah, this is returning the favor. Here. They have viewers. Hey, Derek. <laughs> That's not, that is not nice. I mean, they have a lot of them. Uh, fun fact, I did some math. And if you took all of your, just your Instagram followers alone, did you know this? If I took yours and your Instagram and you put them together, you have more followers than the entire nation of Iceland. That's true. They have, I'll take it. They are BFDs on the internet. They are Can't BFDs. That. I don't, is that the right B math? Big fucking deals is what I'm saying. Fuck yeah. yeah. That's right. BFDs. And Love you can it. swear here, which is fun. So we can we swear on potty. Oh, that's right. You that do. was the reason why we made it. They do shit themselves. censored on every yeah. other platform. That's right. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. So you're doing very well. You're a big uh, screaming success stories. And the other thing I find. Derek, I was your intern. Let's be clear about how we met. <laughs> that is not Let's untrue. Be clear. That is not untrue. Uh, that is what we say true. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> was it six months? Was, it, was that possible? Was it six months? No, it, it was three and I was only part time, but my energy is so large you thought I was there for six months. That's a very good oh, yeah, answer. Yeah. This is the kind of effervescence I'm talking yeah. about. This is exactly what I'm talking about. We just, we just clicked and they we had fun. They didn't keep me on as an intern though. They didn't keep you <laughs> on? We well, didn't too much salad in the background. I don't know what that I means. Was, I was spending <laughs> all of my moments in the cafeteria. I just kept... I love the cafeteria. And I love media. that you say cafeteria. That speaks to how young you are. It. It's a commissary, which oh. is what adults say. Oh, is that say. what it's called You're there? adorably young, and I love that about you. I didn't even uh, know that. The commissary. Yeah, We're so he, now the thing is we had like a good hour to let uh, to let everything breathe and joke around and tell a bunch of stories. Yes. But on this tiny little show, we have to get right to the business. There's Everybody, a timer. I'm We're really getting stressed. right to this. Are you ready for 10 quick questions? I guess yeah, so. Yeah, do it. Oh, Woo! 10 quick questions. Oh, my God. I wrote things down. So okay. here's what's going to happen. Don't overthink it. It's real easy. I'm going to bounce 10 quick questions off you Rapid take fire, you answer, we can go back and forth, you can take it yourself or, or ha hand off to one of your partners. Okay. Either way, you have to get more than seven right or we will have you tasered. Okay, I love game Okay, so shows, here we go. So. Oh, uh, also I forgot we have a brand new sponsor. I gotta get this out. Uh, uh, 10 Quick Questions is brought to you by Bouyonce, the stylish life jacket for all the single ladies. Are you just doing this because we had a nice No, I have pod. sponsors. He was jealous. We had a sponsor on ours. If you okay? like it, you should have put a life jacket on it. All right. Uh, <laughs> learn more at buoyance.gov. Yeah, I have sponsors. Ooh, thank right. you, sponsor. Uh, so here we go. Uh, question number one. Mr. Zebra, Yes, Anastasia, and Cornflake Girl are songs by A, Tori Amos, or B, Down With Webster. Go. True. Down With Webster is the only one. I thought you said true. <laughs> 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 
truly was the, don't know what you're talking down about. Down with Webster was 50 the only chance. thing I understood in that sentence. Tori Amos or down with Webster? Which is it? I'm going down My with Webster. My last name's Webster, so I'm going with down with Webster. So wrong. It's Tori Amos is the right answer. Uh, corn no, flakes. My also Tori. Corn flakes. That's why I did that. that, right? See what I'm doing here? It's Shoot. all tied okay. together. So, this is like the Marvel Cinematic Universe. It's all tied together. We're right in the middle of Captain Marvel 2. Here yeah, we go. Uh, corn flakes were invented uh, to curb people's sexual urges. True or false? Fall, yeah, true. True. Fall, I was going to say yeah, true. true. My instinct true. was true. It actually is true. It, 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 yeah. was, it was meant to make people... Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't a good Very, handshake. very <laughs> confident. Uh, I Want to Sex You Up was a one-hit wonder. What was the band? Was it A, Real to Real, 2, Together, or C, Color Me Bad? What are these questions I want to sex you up. She knows the song. We can't it? afford it. She just costs us $10,000. <laughs> Who's... <laughs> yeah. You know the song. Uh, Who's the B? No clue. What was the B? B was Together. I'm so young, Derek. These are horrible questions for me. That's why I did this. I hate these. I feel very youthful. Give me an answer! I said B. B. You the did, and you're one. so wrong. It's color me bad, of course. <laughs> I'm uh, okay. Holy uh, this is what? made for us to look dumb. Oh, yes! <laughs> what does a reel to reel machine do? A. Thresh wheat. B. Play audio. Or C. Connect phone calls. Play audio. Play audio is absolutely right. And the audience Ooh. goes wild. Yeah. Because you got one right. Uh, what's older, my relationship or Tori? Your what's relationship. My Your relationship? relationship? For sure. Incorrect. You're older by what? one month. By one month. Whoa, uh, how do you know her birthday? Tori was born in 1995, August. No, it wasn't. Uh, well, then you Google were all was wrong. wrong. <laughs> Aren't you August? My wiki is false, Derek. August 5th, 96, baby. August 5th, 96? Yeah. I've been together longer with my wife so than she's been alive. I was there right. You go. <laughs> we get another point? Yeah! This just speaks to how old I am. <laughs> Forbes magazine, not you. My father Forbes, you know. you're her father. Uh, uh, it's claimed that Francoise Betancourt Myers is the richest woman in the world. What did she say? You should know this based on the things that you get in the mail for free. Uh, Prada? This Lipstick. is one for you. Lipstick. Makeup? She's from L'Oreal. She has 49.3 oh. point point billion. Woo! All right, we'll take that. Sure, I'll find. Uh, <laughs> oh, uh, Shit Talk, which is part of your thing, the Shit Talk Our that you guys do in your podcast, Logan. is an actual podcast out of New Zealand that discusses the latest developments in agricultural fertilizer. True or false? False. I want it to be false because I don't She's want to copyright claim. She's caught on. It's You're false. Lying. It's totally, it's totally yeah. false. Absolutely. Uh, Tori starred in Life with Boys, as you probably know. Uh, but I have had a life with girls, as I've only lived with women my entire life. True or false? True. True. You're all. It's almost true. It's actually false, but it's 16 to 2. 16 oh. women, 2 men. I do have a father. <laughs> uh, name an Instagram influencer who deserves way more followers than they have. Do a plug for them right now. Greta! Greta? Oh, yes, that's exactly yes. right. That's why they're applauding. Mine was much less like activism based. <laughs> <laughs> There's this guy, Trust Dan me. Larson. He makes Dan Larson? rye bread. He makes just rye bread. bread? Just makes bread. It's a great Instagram. Go so, check it out. climate change, rye bread. You we got priorities, our priorities are. figured out. <laughs> And finally, what reality show would you two have a uh, the best shot at winning and why? Answer Three, for, two, wait, 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 wait. Answer we'll the for each other. Go ahead. Oh, answer for me and I'll answer for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bachelor, Bachelor for you. Oh. Ah. Yes. Are they right, audience? Did they get more than seven out of seven? I no. think we did. Did they? Woo, woo, woo. I'm not sure that math checks out. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're looking at a C plus at best, but they're A plus people either way. Do me a favor. Go check out their podcast. Go check out their show, Potty Talk. You have a thousand things on the go. Just follow these wonderful wares. I don't have their I don't have their thing. But my point is, they're delightful. They own the internet, and they're awesome, and they're Tori, and they're Jacqueline. Let Thanks, them hear it. There they thank, go. You. There go. Thank, you, thank you. Thank you. I'm going to go over here. Yeah, uh, let's bring somebody up to the stage who is offensively tall. Uh, <laughs> to us uh, garden gnomes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, he's delightfully talented. He is performing at the Rivoli January 22nd at the Asian Comedy All-Stars. But you know what? That doesn't matter because he's right here right now. Please welcome g Van Gale. Yeah, buddy. Oh, see? Look. <laughs> oh, dear God. This is great. I didn't get a mic yet. <laughs> Take that one. That one will work. Keep it professional. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm really pleasurable to be on the show right now, uh, which is a godsend for people like me with ADD. Um, I uh, recently started going to the weed store. Uh, <laughs> I, I, tried, I tried to stick it out. When weed became legal, I was like, no, screw that. I'm sticking with my dealer. I've been with this guy for years, you know? And plus, <laughs> shop locally, you know? But I, eventually, I just got tired of buying uh, weed in bag meant for sandwiches. You know, I just wanted some professionalism in my life. 
Uh, so I started going to the weed store. Um, I th- I'll tell you where it, became ap- it came apart was when I went to see my dealer and he didn't even have a bag. He just reached into his pocket and pulled out some weed and just sprinkled it into my hand. <laughs> and I was like, did you just give me pocket weed? Really? <laughs> All right, screw this. I'm out. I, uh, I enjoy I'm not from um, Toronto originally. I'm from Vancouver. I enjoy living here. It's uh, You guys have the best uh, crazy people on the subway by far. <laughs> Top notch, best in the country for sure. Uh, I was recently on the subway, uh, there was, and I was listening to my music. I just had my headphones in, and there was uh, some yelling over here. So I did what you're supposed to do, which is I turned off my music without looking up, just kept watching with my ears, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just I just snuck a glance for a second. It was a it was a Jesus guy. He had a Bible, and he was yelling about Jesus, and he's just like, Jesus is the light. Jesus is your savior. Jesus will guide you to the kingdom of heaven. And I'm like, he was like, actually, a literal Bible thumper. I've never seen that before. <laughs> and the thing, it was classic Toronto Transit. It got stuck. And it was stuck for so long yeah. that I saw him go, like, pause <laughs> and look away. And I, I've been a comedian for 10 years. I know what that look means. I'm like, you ran out of material, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> and he did. He was like, Jesus. I was like, no, you did that one already. Let's go. <laughs> new, jo- new jokes, new jokes. Anyways, thank you so much for having me. I've been Jeevan <laughs> Gill. Good night. That's Jeevan Gill. He's right there. And so are you. That's the show. Good night. We're breaking stuff. Yeah, knock shit over. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs>